Heartland Sports with Jess Todd. Sponsored by Southeast Orthopedics and Sports Medicine. Silver basketball is no joke in the Heartland. We have some serious talent coming up, and especially for a 2028 group, TC Hoops, who's already won three different tournaments so far this summer. Here's a look at a couple of them after we got to catch up with them at practice today. In May, it was the U.S. Junior Nationals Gateway Challenge in St. Louis. And then in June, the Battle of the Borough in Lebanon, Missouri. How about in July this month, a couple weeks ago, the run for the Roses Championships, Blue Gold Division. This team is on an absolute roll. They are made up of incoming eighth graders, Addison Henderson from Jackson, Ella Cook from Woodland, Addison Tate from Jackson, Ivy Benson, Twin Rivers, Kate Deck, Jackson, Kenzie Keys from Jackson, Lily Harper, Jackson, and Reagan Gwynn from Jackson, as well as some incoming seventh graders playing up as well. We have Aubrey Breaker from Jackson, a lot of Jackson on this squad, but don't make it twisted. We got some talent from the other towns as well. Lila Porter from Puxico, Lily McDonough from Leopold. They don't actually have a basketball for girls team at Leopold, so she just wanted to get in there to make sure her basketball level is getting up. This group has been with head coach Terry Helms since they were in fourth grade. They put in the time. He knows just how much work they've put in and what sets them apart. After you've had them for that long, you know, they, they become like your kids, you know, and like I said, they, they are a close-knit group because they have been together and they want to achieve the same thing, so that, that makes them close, but I am about fun. I want them to enjoy the game as much as I do. Ever since I joined, it just brought my basketball game to the whole other level, meeting new competition, meeting the team, and just it's been great. Whenever I first came in, I remember they were so welcoming. Like, it was like overwhelmingly friendly, and so I just felt so at home so fast. It doesn't matter if you're new or you're old, they just accept you and it's just, you get along with them so well. You get to make new friends from different schools and so you get to create new bonds and then like, it's just a lot better than your school team because it's just like an outgoing experience. Knowing each other and getting to like play as a team has gotten us closer and winning is making just us, I think, a ton closer and making us better friends. Well, this squad is something else. They have another tournament coming up August 4th through 6th back in Louisville. We're going to keep you updated on that because they just keep winning everything. Congratulations to TC Hoops. They are something to behold this summer. And how, how about some more good news on the gridiron so far this summer? Al Young, the Cape Central standout who set 12 school records during his three-time All-State career with the Tigers, has received an XFL Combine Invitational to play at the Division I level with SEMO before transferring to Jackson State. The XFL Combine coming up July 25th to 27th in Arlington, Texas for a chance to make an XFL roster in 2024. And all of us in the heartland are going to be rooting for Al Young.